Charles from the Knickerbockers. Hi, how are you? John, it's yes. great to have you here. I was just saying how we used to go into the Red Velvet back in the good old days, and here you guys do your Beatle medley, and we were amazed that you sounded just like the Beatles. Well, we, we love the Beatles, and it was had a big, big effect on our band, and of course, Lies, everyone said, was like a well, Beatles Well, then song. when Lies came out on the radio, mm -hmm. we thought it was the Beatles, till we heard the DJ say, and that's Lies by the Knickerbockers, and Jeff Cotton and I looked at each other and went, that's that great group from the Red Velvet. That's right, those were great days there. And actually, I was telling you a moment ago, was <laughs> Lies was the B-side of that record. We were, we were fighting with our record company, and they gave us the B-side because we were screaming so much, and that's how it happened. Well, it's good that the DJs flipped it over and played the B-side, and it was a big hit. Well, a lot of the DJs came into the Red Velvet, where you saw us, and they said, we don't like the, the, that record, but we'll play Lies, and that's how it happened. All right. Yeah, God, it's great to see you here today, great John. To see you.
Come on down to the Tiki Lounge A little grass shack with a bamboo bar